friends, how's it going today? I'm super hyped because we get to open up our first packs of celebrations. Goodness, with these two mini tins featuring my two favorite starter Pokemon, Charmander and Trico. So let's crack into the Hoenn one first. So here's the Hoenn tin without the plastic wrap on it. There was a little smudge on Trico's eye that I was able to wipe off, which is good. So let's see what we get inside these. I haven't watched anybody open them. Wow, that is a big coin. Oh my gosh. I really hope that they don't make this a huge trend. I do enjoy the occasional big coin, but these are very large and I have no idea how to display them. But this is a very cool sparkly pattern. It's really reminiscent of the first coins that came out for the TCG, so that's really neat. We also have our little mini art card, so this time it doesn't have a border, which is very nice. I do prefer it to not have a border so that you can put them all together at the end. And then on the back, we have a picture of all eight of them. Oh, they're all so cute. I'm really happy that I was able to get my two favorite regions, but I would love to get the rest of them too. And then for our packs, we got our two celebrations and then one darkness ablaze, which is pretty sweet. But let's open up the Kanto one so that we have all the packs at once. So here's the Kanto tin without the plastic wrap on it. I love that they included the Pikachu tail to have an homage to yellow version. Very, very cool there. Then we have the coin and the art card, just like the Hoenn tin. Then we have our two packs of celebrations and one pack of darkness ablaze again. Let's open up our two darkness ablaze packs first, since uh, the most exciting thing is celebrations, of course. And you know, darkness ablaze is still a very exciting set because I still don't have the uh, English version of the regular Charizard from this set. So let's see what we've got. We got a lightning energy, a Furret, Flaffy, Eridos, Rookity, Torchic, Trapinch. Those are some great cards right there. We got a Jigglypuff, a Ducklet, a Hiding Energy Reverse, and then our rare is a Talonflame non hollow That is a very cool artwork for Talonflame. I do very much enjoy that Pokemon. Onto our second Darkness of Lace pack with a Charizard G Max on the front. I do, of course, love Charizard G Max, so it's it's always nice to see Darkness of Lace packs just for just to see the Charizard. So we've got a Grass Energy, a Dedenne, Dartrix, Clang. Galarian Mr. Mime, Rookity, Tauros, Snubble, Mareep, a Rowlet Reverse, and then our bear is a Hoopa Hollow. Now that's very cool to get a Hollow from a Darkness of Blaze pack here. And then we have our four packs of celebrations. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I haven't seen anybody open these yet. I mean, there's plenty of videos, obviously, but I haven't watched anybody open them yet because I was trying to sort of savor the experiment experience and, and leave it for myself. Uh, so I don't know what the card trick is, if there is one, but wow, we're starting off with the Xerneas, which is very, very pretty. I love that artwork. Oh my gosh. Then we have a Reshiram, very cool artwork there too. I think this is a, a reprint uh, as far as I remember. Then we've got a Cosmog with Lily in the background. Very, very cute. This Hollows pattern is kind of hard to catch on camera. I don't know what's happening here. It's kind of like a mirror in a way. And then I guess our final card is a Sassian V. Wow, that is so cool. Are we are we guaranteed a, a Pokemon V in every pack? Uh, I don't I don't remember how these cards are supposed to work, but wow, this is amazing. Uh, Masahiro Arita drew this artwork, so that is very, very cool. And then we've got a code card in the back, so I will save that to the next pack so i guess now i know that the best card is i guess it's always going to be the very last card so so that's kind of helpful uh, and then there's also a code card that I'll just move away. So here we go. We've got a Reshiram, a Cosmog again. We're doing some deja vu. And we got a birthday Pikachu. Yay. Oh my gosh. I uh, I neglected to actually buy one of these when uh, it was less expensive. And now I don't think I ever will buy one. But it's so great to have a reprinted version of it. That is wonderful. And then our rare. Oh, we got a Professor's Research Full Art. Oh my gosh. I have no idea how rare any of these cards are. I haven't looked up. But like just looking at them it's just so cool these cards are amazing look at professor oak he's just stacking up those books like a professor should that is awesome okay on to our next pack this is our second to last celebrations pack these packs are so much fun oh my gosh i can't believe it uh this one i i shouldn't have done that that was a bad choice on my part oh geez i'm having problems opening because i'm just so excited so here we go we've got a groudon with uh the team magma uh, I guess admins in the front. That is very, very cool. I forget her name, but I think that's Tabitha. Anyway, very awesome to see Groudon. We got another Rush Ram. Is a Rush Ram in every pack in this set? What is going on here? Then we got a Claydol, which is the cosmic power one from Great Encounters. That is very, very cool. I just realized that there's like a texture on these cards too. Can you see that? Yeah, you can see that in the camera. That is interesting. I didn't, I didn't notice that before. And then our last card is a Pikachu full art. All right. So this is a full art version of the 
uh, adorable base set Pikachu card. So that is very cool to have this too. Is this textured? No, it's just, it's just hollow. Very, very awesome. And then our final pack of celebrations for the day. I, I really, I'm enjoying this very, very much. The, the reprinted cards are so much fun. I love the texture on them. It's kind of funny to see Claydol again in 2021. I used to play Claydol in all of my decks during that era. Oh my gosh, this pack is so broken. Jeez, I, I'm sorry. I'm just having so many issues today, but, but it'll be okay. All right, so we're gonna move the code card and then there's no pack trick. So we've got a Groudon, a Lugia. Wow, that is so cool. Look at that artwork. Oh my gosh. Again, I, I actually didn't look at the uh, the leaks for this set. So a lot of these are gonna be brand new to me. So that is awesome. Then we've got another, uh, for real, we got a Rush Rim in every pack. What is happening here? And then I think this is our final card. We got a Professor's Research. All right, so this is the one where Professor Oak is like writing on the card. I did see this before the set came out. So that is awesome. Wow. So this opening was so much fun. We have our Hoopa Hollow from Dark ablaze but then in the celebrations goodness we've got our zacian v our birthday pikachu which is so so cute we have our full art base set pikachu which is very awesome and then our professor's research full art which is just so awesome i really love these supporter full arts so okay guys give you guys this celebrations booster code comment and let us know what you got so that we know that you've taken it so thanks for watching everybody look forward to more celebrations in the future and i'll catch you all on the flip side